Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, I originally recorded this one about the same time I did the Stealth Dragon video, but I ended up losing this video somehow. I'm not really sure. I think it was when I restarted my computer, but anyway, this week I have uh, my other big old or big old custom creation that I'd like to review so I can break it apart and use its parts for something else finally with that said with that said here is the big tractor mech thing As you can see, this thing is fairly large, and I don't really want to touch it similar to the Stealth Dragon, because it's a little bit precarious where it's standing right here. But as you can kind of see, maybe, it's kind of inspired by a cross between the Star Wars ATST and old 1940s 1950s John Deere tractors and I suppose that would make it a bit of a diesel punk mech maybe I'm not really sure this whole thing basically started out with um my want to try to make oops Try to make a Gatlin gun out of minifigure binoculars. And then I just ended up building a mech around that idea. I tried at least, or this is actually the second time I tried to build this machine. The first time didn't go so well, and I tried to incorporate a two passenger cargo, or a two passenger system, and that didn't work very well. But I downsized it and ended up making it as a single, single passenger system, which, yeah, a single passenger system. And this thing's legs are fully poseable, at least to some extent. Although, as I mentioned earlier, it's a little precariously perched here so I can't do too much with it but what I can do or at least what I designed for it to do is as you can see it has wheels if you fold up the legs uh this is not going very well <laughs> okay let's see You can enter it into a sort of rapid transportation mode by folding up its legs a bit. Not sure how useful such a mode would be. And actually, it probably would be pretty useful. I mean, I didn't really have to do that. It's just, I thought it would be fun. As you saw the Gatling gun there. These are two energy mortars. Kind of like the, um, oh, what's it called? The Sky Hammer from Vigilante 8? Maybe? A little bit of the bullseye. Um, no, not bullseye. Oh, whatever. The rotating cannon, too. Um, yeah. Out the, oh, and it's tippy. Out the back here, I have these panels fold up. So you can see some engine detailing. I'm using these old chrome mufflers, which right now are basically semi-transparent clear. I don't want to get new ones because those little things are expensive. And I suppose with that all being said, I'm going to try to rip... Oh, I'm missing a piece. Anyway, um... Yeah. Oops. 
Okay, let's see. As I mentioned earlier, there was a driver's compartment in here. And the pilot just sits in there. So, yeah. Thanks for watching. And everything just went horribly wrong. And if you would like some instructions for this thing, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching and see you guys later.